I would describe grace as a lightning bolt, sometimes a small miracle. I do remember when I thought I got the lightning bolt. CYO practice after the practice, the cool girls, the it girls were picking on somebody and I was with the, you know, non-it girls and they were being cruel. I had a tiny voice, but I made my voice come out and I said, you are mean, don't be so mean. She's a nice girl. And they gave all the reasons why they thought she was not a nice girl. And I said, no, she's very nice, I know it. Don't be cool, it's unfair. So they were stunned, she was stunned, and the nerdy girls were stunned. Everybody looked at me like I was from Mars. A week or so passed, and Sister Cecilia sent two people back to get the lunch out of the cloakroom. It turned out to be me and the girl that had been picked upon. And we got in there, she hugged me and said, I'm so sorry that I stayed with the mean girls, but I had to, that's, that's my group. And I never thanked you. And I always thought I should come to you and ask you to forgive me for that. Well, I thought this, there's the lightning bolt. For her to admit to me that she couldn't side with me then, she had to go with her crew. And uh, that took an awful lot. And uh, she was so honest. And that, it wasn't just me speaking out and using the voice. The real thing came later with the vindication and the uh, asking for forgiveness. From then on, I have to tell you, I had a voice. and and I became more of an advocate in, in my life and how I lived my life, it feeds me.